Hi, I'm Sean Carellas, and welcome to How Do I on Butterscotch.com. This series, we're taking a look at the BlackBerry Playbook from Research in Motion. This episode, we're going to talk about connecting your BlackBerry Playbook to a larger display using HDMI. Now, the nice thing about the BlackBerry Playbook is it has a micro HDMI connector built right into the device. This means when you have the proper cable, you can connect it to an external display, whether it's a small one on the desktop or a larger one like this. Now, of course, to make this work, you're going to need an HDMI cable, one that has micro HDMI on one side to connect into the BlackBerry Playbook, and one that has regular HDMI on the other in order to connect to your display. We've got this one from Hipstreet, which is about 1.5 meters, or about 4.5 feet. You should be able to find or at least order one of these types of cables wherever your BlackBerry Playbook is sold. So to make your connection, you take the small end of your HDMI cable and plug it into the bottom of the Playbook. Then you plug the other end into the television. Then you have a few options you may want to set up on the BlackBerry Playbook. From the main screen, swipe down from the top bezel and bring up the settings menu. On the left hand bar, click on HDMI. At the top, there's a slider that allows you to automatically mirror the display. If this isn't already turned on, turn it on and the display should appear on your big screen. There's also an option for determining the aspect ratio of your screen. You can set this to stretch, zoom, fill the screen, or normal, which might leave edges around the display on the screen. You also have a pull down menu below, which allows you to change the type of display you're using. You can select between 60 and 50 Hz refresh. You can also change between 1080i and 720p displays. You can also turn HDMI audio off here, so if you don't want the audio from your playbook going through to the big screen, this is where you turn that off. Don't forget to check out the other parts in the series for other ways of interacting with the BlackBerry playbook. And you can see the show notes for this part and the other parts in the series at butterscotch.com.